what's up guys, it's Steph, and today we're going to be doing a TBR video Wop. <laughs> for the Respawn-a-thon, which is this weekend's from the 25th, February 25th, to, no, February 23rd to February 25th, sorry. This is a readathon created by Libra Libra, I believe, I hope I'm pronouncing that right. I will link her channel below and in the card up above me. Pretty much what this is is a video game related readathon and things kind of related to video games, so you know, we're going to have fun with this. There are only four categories, but there are going to be reading challenges on both their Twitter, the twi or the Twitter account for this readathon, and the account hosting, I believe. You gotta go check her out, check out her video to know more. Go look at it, it's in the description. Anyway, there are four categories of books for this one. I'm going to be filling in three, because for number four, we'll, we'll get there when we get there, okay? Number one, Warp Zone, a book that will take you to another world. For that one, I am choosing The Planet Thieves by uh, Dan Kronkos. I... Kronkos. I don't know how to say his last name. This is one I got from Book Depository back when they gave me that $5 coupon, and I just went for the super bargain books. So I believe this one is a middle grade novel. The characters are about 13, and they're on a, um, the Academy for Earth Space Command boarded on SS Egypt. The trip was supposed to be a short routine voyage log that required space time for several quarter. But then, you know, things go rogue. I believe they're space pirates. It's gonna be a fun one. It turns out, like, all the 13-year-olds are the only ones left alive. And it all takes place in space. I'm excited. It's a really short one. Like I said, I don't really know that much about it other than the description. I didn't look at any reviews or anything. This is one of the ones I kind of blindly picked. Because the cover looks kind of cool, don't it? I mean, look at that. Pretty neato, and I'm excited to check it out. Number two, Power Up, a book where the char main character has abilities or powers. For that, I'm going with vampires and other monstrous creatures because these guys have their powers, they have their mysterious stuff, and plus it looks really, really cool. And it's short, so I'm excited. <laughs> Number three, press start to continue. Read a sequel novel. For this one, I am going to be continuing Undead with Benefits by Jeff Hart. This is the sequel to Eat Brains Love, which is follows these two zom zombies. These two teenagers have contracted the zombie virus, and they're trying to find a cure or a way... A safe place and this is the continuation of that story I am enjoying it so far I am currently 53 pages in to a 400 page book very thick <laughs> hopefully I can get a bit further in it this weekend and maybe even finish it that'd be great finally number four is a bonus round and we all know those ones are the best rounds for this one you can read any video game related book any kind of strategy guide or a graphic novel now, I used to be so into getting the strategy guides for games, I used to have a ton of them. Unfortunately, right now, I don't know where any of them are. So that being said, I don't really have anything for this category. Even my comic books at the moment are kind of hard to get to, so I can't really look through those to see if I have anything that would fit this. Although graphic novel is very wide, I could probably pull out any comic book, but... You know, <laughs> I don't really have access to them at the moment, so I'm not going to be doing anything for the bonus round. Exit. And yeah, that's my TBR for the Respawnathon. If you guys are interested in this readathon, I highly recommend checking out the um, the original video because it looks fun. I mean, a thing relate like related to video games. I am so down for it. It's so exciting. There, looking at it, there really isn't that much with to do with video games and BookTube. So, so to see these things combined is fantastic. I really hope you guys check this out. It looks like so much fun. And plus, it's just a weekend thing. If you're looking for something to do this weekend because you're not out partying it up, why not party it up with a readathon. <laughs> That's all I've got for you guys today. I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you check out the Respawnathon. I hope you have a lovely day slash night. I'll see you later.